the local festival may be the ideal target for scammers. Yeah, one million people are expected to hit the roads of Park County for this year's Covered Bridge Festival, and police are warning vendors to be on the lookout for counterfeit money. Yeah, this issue has also been felt in other surrounding mm -hmm. counties. Zeke Torres has some tips on how you can avoid being shortchanged. <laughs> According to police, vendors are more likely to see fake money during time of festivals, and residents are asked to be cautious. Off the courthouse lawn in Rockville, hundreds of vendors and residents kick off a chilly Friday morning celebrating one of Indiana's largest festivals. I'm anticipating a pretty good crowd this year. In attendance is the Rowdy Rooster T-shirt company. They focus on screen printing, bulk orders, and creative merch. Kind of a fun little thing to do every year, be a part of the community. Owner Julie Kroll said the Covered Bridge Festival is also vital for her company's growth. Communicating with, you know, local companies and businesses as they pass through. Um, it's been really good for me. I've got to talk to a lot of new clients, picked up several clients over the last couple of years. Kroll and others are on the lookout for scammers. In Brazil, a woman was recently arrested and charged with forgery. Chief Clint McQueen said typical scams include making fake money and people giving counterfeit bills to a vendor for a cash exchange. It's a problem that can spread quickly. They'll try to travel through the different cities, towns, and it's, a, it's kind of a numbers game for them. They're not going to do it at every business here because they know it'll get back very quick. Charges range from a misdemeanor to a felony. Owners can protect themselves by buying a counterfeit pen and by checking a bill's texture. Elderberry's Health Syrup also offers a card payment option to protect itself and customers. It's definitely a concern. I used to be in banking and therefore I realize that it's more common than people realize it is to get counterfeit bills. The Covered Bridge Festival will run from now until October 23rd. Reporting in Park County, I'm Zeke Torres.